Championship Friday and Sunday, March 18th and 20th. The number one seed as expected, Temple, ranked number one in the nation, 29-1. and one. The Atlantic 10 champions will go against Lehigh, making only its second appearance ever in this tournament as East Coast Conference champions. Georgetown, the eighth seed, makes its 10th straight NCAA appearance under John Thompson. The 1984 champions will play LSU. The Bengal Tigers, with 13 losses, were certainly on the fence. Georgia Tech, the fifth seed. The loss to Maryland hurt the Yellow Jackets seeding. Iowa State, one of the five Big 8 teams, will go against the Yellow Jackets. Number four seed, Indiana, the defending champions, Bobby Knight looking for his fourth tournament title, will go against Richmond, the Spiders, the champs of the Colonial Athletic Association. Continuing in the East, games to be played in Chapel Hill, North Carolina, Thursday and Saturday, March 17th and 19th. Second seed goes to Duke, the ACC champions, against Boston University. Now, BU head coach Mike Jarvis did a marvelous job this year. He coached Patrick Ewing in high school. SMU's the number seven seed, right now playing Baylor for the Southwest Conference title, will go against Notre Dame, the Fighting Irish with a 20 and eight record. Missouri is the sixth seed. Norm Stewart in his 21st year with the Tigers will go against Rhode Island with 26 wins. Three of those six losses for Rhode Island were against top ranked Temple. It is a strong ball club. Syracuse is the third seed. Last year's runner up will play North Carolina A&T. Seven appearances for North Carolina A&T and yet they have never won a ball game. So there you have it. the number one seed there, as expected, the Purdue Boilermakers with a 27 and three record will go against Fairleigh Dickinson University, the ECAC Metro champions. The eighth seed is Baylor against number nine, Memphis State. Both are playing conference championships at this very moment. DePaul is the fifth seed. Joey Myers, fourth trip to the tournament. Wichita State, another fine coaching job by Eddie Fogler for the Shockers. Kansas State is in, playing Oklahoma right here in Kansas City for the title of the Big Eight will go against LaSalle, the Metro Conference champions. The number two seed is Pittsburgh. They will play in Lincoln, Nebraska, Friday and Saturday, March 18th and 20th. They will play Eastern Michigan, which comes in as the 15th seed. Vanderbilt, the seventh seed. First appearance for Vanderbilt since 1974, and will go against the 10th seed, Utah State. Kansas against Xavier. Now this is a matchup of superstars. Kansas led by Danny Manning, Xavier led by Byron Larkin. NC State, Jim Valvano, a tournament coach, and he'll go against Murray State, the 14th seed, out of the Ohio Valley Conference. So there, Georgia, Thursday and Saturday, March 17th and 19th. And the top seed there, again, as expected, one of the highest scoring teams in the tournament, Oklahoma, will go against Tennessee Chattanooga. Auburn comes out of the Southeast Conference, will play Bradley University, and there at Bradley is Hersey Hawkins, the nation's scoring leader. The fifth seed is Louisville, playing for the Metro title right now, even as we speak. And they'll go against Oregon State, the 12th seed, out of the Pac-10. BYU moves over into the southeast bracket as a four seed. And they'll go against North Carolina Charlotte. Interesting note, the 49ers' only other appearance was 1977, and they won it all. In Cincinnati, Ohio, Friday and Sunday, March 18th and 19th, the number two seed, Kentucky, will go against Southern University. The Maryland Terrapins, with a big win in the Atlantic Coast Conference over Georgia Tech, will go against UC Santa Barbara. Now, the Gauchos beat UNLV twice this year. It is a strong ball club. Villanova, the number six seed against Arkansas. Nolan Richardson's Razorbacks are into the tournament. The number three seed out of the Big Ten, Illinois, will go against 14th seeded Texas San Antonio, Trans-American Athletic Champions. So there and again, it. as expected, the top seed, Lute Olson's Arizona team, the number one seed out west will go against Cornell out of the Ivy League, the champions of that conference. Seton Hall, first time ever in this tournament. Congratulations to the Pirates. The number eight seed will play UTEP, Texas El Paso. The number five seed, Iowa, will go against the Seminoles of Florida State, which come in as the number 12 seed. Number four, UNLV. A little bit of a surprise against Southwest Missouri State. You can watch that game here on CBS Friday night, 1130 Eastern time. Now in the West, these games to be played in Salt Lake City Thursday and Saturday, 17th and 19th of March. Number two, North Carolina. A little bit of a surprise to be placed out West against the 15th seed, which is North Texas State. Wyoming with Fennis Dembo, the WAC champs, will go against Loyola Marymount, the highest scoring team in the nation. The sixth seed, the University of Florida, and the Gators go against St. John's, which was on the fence with a 17 and 12 record. And you can see them here on CBS Thursday night, 11.30 Eastern time. The number three seed is Michigan. 
and Michigan will go against Boise State. That's out west Thursday and Saturday, Salt Lake City, Utah.